Hi, this is Alex from 3D Chimera. Today I'm going to show you how to import a print profile into Simplify 3D. So if you're working with 3D Chimera and you're working on a German RepRap 3D printer, for example, um, we're going to have pre-made print profiles that are going to have all the settings and parameters that are going to work for your prints right off the bat. And so uh, rather than getting in there and kind of messing with all these different settings in order to uh, set up your ideal print, you can go with one of our standard profiles on a standard material and focus only on infill percentage if you want to raft or not or if you want to have support. Helps to make things a little bit easier as you are getting started. So uh, we'll go ahead and go through the process here. So we'll say File, Import FFF Profile. So I'm going to go into my repository here. You can see we have uh, different printers and different extruders as well as uh, different print profiles. So we're going to grab this guy, which is for the X500 printer using the DD4 extruder with PETG material, uh, the 3D Chimera branded type. So we'll go ahead and import that. It says uh, the filing profiles are imported, and now available from our drop-down list. So if we go in here and uh, we look to the end, you'll see that that's loaded in there. This is our new print profile. And if we look under advanced, all of our settings are in here. So we have our different uh, layer settings, um, all the different variables that basically allow us to have a successful print. So that's the process. Once you do that, you are good to go. You'll see the bed automatically adjust to the shape that it needs to be. If we were to select any other 3D printer, uh, let's say one of our X400 3D printers, um, we have other print profiles that are made. In this case, it happens to be for Zytel. But you can see here, there's tons of them. These can be adjusted by you guys. They can be adjusted by us. And that's the best way for us to communicate um, critical file parameters back and forth is to share either the factory file where the FFF comes along for the ride or to upload or start with uh, fresh FFF files. If you ever need one, uh, just reach out and we'll be happy to send you over a profile for materials that we have. If you happen to be printing on a material that you didn't get from 3D Chimera, but maybe it's similar to something that we already work with, just let us know. We'll be happy to send you what the closest material is so that you can upload that and have a good starting point. Okay, that's it.